covering the week's top tech stories with a slight Linux bias. Samsung users, unplug your Ethernet. Millions of Samsung Blu-ray and DVD players are being bricked all around the world. Entertainment has become one of the biggest tools for keeping sane during these trying times, but while many companies are aggressively pushing their streaming services, others still prefer owning the media they buy in physical form. That mostly means DVDs and Blu-ray discs, which, of course, require appropriate devices to play them. But what if those devices all suddenly stop working for no apparent reason? That's the rather eerie and frustrating situation that owners of Samsung Blu-ray players are now experiencing, experiencing around the world with no answer or solution yet in sight. There doesn't seem to be any common denominator other than the fact that it's happening across a number of Samsung's Wi-Fi or Ethernet connected Blu-ray and DVD players. It doesn't appear to matter which model. The most common behavior reported is that the players reboot themselves after a few seconds, causing an inescapable boot loop. Others have reported hearing noises as if the players were reading empty disk slots. Given the mysterious and sudden appearance of the bug, some people have different theories on what caused it. Some blame an overnight firmware update, but the range of devices covered is so wide and random that it seems less likely. Some believe it may be an expired SSL security certificate in the firmware, which could explain why no amount of resetting the device to factory settings seems to work. Unfortunately, Samsung remains unresponsive despite the growing number of complaints, possibly due to how it happened during the weekend. Given global conditions, it's understandable how owners are not so amused, especially if it will require them to turn in the device for manual servicing. Thank you.